Okay, guys, how's it going? Um, so it's, uh, we'll get kind of check out some other clans and stuff. And, uh, checked out this clan. I got on Norsk real quick and Norsk Global and, um, took a look on there and got an invite from a pretty high level. It's a uh, Fallen Saviors. It's a level 11 clan. And, and uh, this one is basically a go-ho with a couple loons. Just taking out a couple strategic defenses. So I'm going to do these, just doing a few recaps on these because I think they're going to be helpful for us. Now this base, you see you've got exposed defenses here, here, and here. And if you can drop a loon... Here you can pretty much get a one for one. There, they'll go after that. They'll take out the archer tower. Now nothing's here to take out the mortar, or take out the balloons. Go into the mortar. So you only need two balloons for that because it'll they'll work their way over here. Um, I made four, uh, one there and then three still in the bag. Um, did that because you know if there's an air bomb or something, then uh, I'll lose one of them. So and that'll ruin everything. So I just brought one extra just in case. So, uh, there's one there. That archer tower. Gonna take out that mortar. Dragon comes out. So I get a nice little dragon lure out of it. And then, I deploy. Basically, just an archer over here. Pull the dragon down. Throw a couple poison spells down. Um, just to get rid of that dragon a little bit. Drop my king, uh, another golem so that way I can suck onto that golem. But it never actually did. And then, dragon, now the golems are working their way in. The rest of the CC troops came out. Queen's going to take care of them. Uh, took out the enemy queen with my king. And the enemy king as well. And now it's just going to be a surgical deployment of hogs throughout the rest of the base. Now I was pretty sure there's going to be a double jump, giant bomb right there. But uh, there was just one and some small bombs. I panicked and then threw another heal spell right here, which turned out really well because there was actually another giant bomb right there. Um, deployed hogs over here, deployed some hogs over here. Uh, there's another double jump because this is a fresh hit. I wasn't expecting it to be right there. But it worked out really well because these hogs come over here. They set it off. The group of my hogs, the mass group, is right here. So I'm actually doing really well. Now the rest of my hogs are going to make their way up. All giant bombs have been cleared, so there's no threats left, which is fine because I don't have any heal spells either. So the rest of those hogs are going to make, uh, drop wizards throughout the rest of the base uh, just to make clean up on everything else a little bit faster. My queen's going to work on her wall. She's really good at doing that. And now she's going to do the rest of the cleanup as well. And that's it for that base. Now this is the other base that I did. Um, suicide dragons. Uh, suicide dragons, what you want to do is you want to try to bring two dragons to take out the enemy queen. And you want to do this whenever, see where the air defenses are. The air defenses are here and here. Um, and then down here, even farther south. So you're actually, you're golden because there's no air defenses that can even uh, hit those dragons. So you bring a few uh, just to create funnel. Um, so that's exactly what I did here. Just brought a few minions just to create my funnel. And uh, threw a giant down here. Because he, I need to go for that mortar, which I thought was going to bring out all the CC troops, but only one minion ends up coming out. But it's no big deal. Um, so there goes the dragons. They're going to work their way in there. They're going to take out the king and queen. So I'm going to zoom all the way out because you're going to see attack up here, and you're going to see an attack down here. Uh, this attack's basically already done. It's going to take its place, and it's going to do its own thing, and I don't have to do anything else. Now I'm going to start my turn because this, this is going to do its own thing. So... That golem, for some stupid reason, didn't go for that mortar like it was supposed to. It decides to go for this cannon, but it works out all right. Um, so wall breakers over here just to get me into this part of the base. And then King's going to make his way in, and he's going he's gonna to pull those CC troops. Um, golem's going to work its way in there. I had to gem my king to get him to 17. Uh, I figured if I'm going to do this war with this clan, I might as well do it full and uh, get my king back, because my king was down for a little while. So, now I'm going to drop a poison spell just to get rid of those minions, and the uh, king will take out the Valkyries, so I'm not too worried about that. And now the queen, I think I, mi I missed her ability on this one, yeah. Now I'm going to start my surgical deployment of hogs. Uh, so, hogs up here, hogs down here. 
Uh, Tesla farm comes up over here. Golems are going to tank for that for just a short little while, but they're not going to last very long because they're just little golemites at this point. And if that dragon had just been a little slower, that air defense would have been taken out and it would have helped me with cleanup even more so. Um, but everything worked out just fine. So all giant bombs have been activated at this point. Uh, there's just a couple cannons and a few Teslas left. And I've got a ton of hogs. And they're going to take out the rest of this base and they make cleanup real nice and quick. And uh, just a couple wizards and an archer doing the rest of the cleanup on the rest of the base. So that went really, really smoothly for me as well. So that's how you do suicide dragons. Actually, or a goblin and two arched them. I should have, especially with that being right there. But it doesn't really matter. All right. Now, something else, one last attack that I really wanted to show you guys, which was pretty awesome. This is a max level Town Hall 10 taken to a max level Town Hall 10. Not maxed yet, but I think everything else is maxed except for cannons and walls and uh, heroes. But I think everything else is maxed. Yeah, it looks like it. So, oh, there's a mortar that's not maxed too. Sends his bowlers in with some healers and uh, starts going uh, with that max level giants in his CC. And they're going to work their way in. He drops a jump spell here. I think he drops another one over here ish. Another jump spell over there somewhere. Um, pay close attention to this. Look how low this bowler's life is. But the healers blasted it right back up once that, once that Inferno Tower went down. They brought, they brought that right back up again, which was pretty awesome. Drops a free spell over here. Bowlers are going to continue to work. Throws another jump spell down. Now, all these bowlers are done. I hate to be a spoiler for that, but uh, all, the boiler, or all the bowlers pretty much die on this. This is pretty amazing, though. Watch the queen. Life's, use the ability. Healers are up here. Healers left on that queen. Now there's two healers left for that queen. She's going to make her way all the way back up around the base. Look at, this, look at the life on the healers. Just a sliver. Now look at her life. Just nothing left. Nothing left. And we're going to times four it because it's going to take, actually, a times two. Sliver again. Down to nothing again. Some miners for the back end. I think he deployed them right around here ish. That was amazing, though. Just amazing. I was watching that attack and I was like, oh my god, she's going to die. And she didn't die. It was pretty cool. So, yeah, that's all I have for you guys. Really good attacks on uh, their part. Doing uh, our base. My base getting whooped on. I don't mind showing my base. Most all their attacks are Govaho. Almost everyone was either Govaho or HGHB. They did a couple of air attacks, which were really impressive, but uh, uh, very many. And these guys are very good war clan. That BRCM, BRCM, that's a real. I've never heard of them, but uh, they're dominating us. Kind of a miss. Their Town Hall 9s are way higher than our Town Hall 9s on this war. I think their lowest level heroes were like 15-ish, and we had a town hall 8. So, I mean, that tells you. And, you know, I was 20, 20 out of 20, that 15 and 7, 15 and 16 level heroes. And so, yeah, it wasn't, uh, wasn't fairly matched at all. So, we're going to speed this up just a little, take a little while to work our way through. Okay, now we're going to start. Since the Giants and Valkyries are going... Already got a jump spell ready to go for it. Access to a ton of my base. And then he's going to just do a search. Surgical into hogs around the outside of the base here. We're going to times two it because I kind of have to speed up. 
And that's basically it. My base is done and over with. But good deck. Today, so next time, clash it out.